Modifying the callout view properties. The first thing we can do is we can uh, control uh, the bubble uh, head or the callout head um, and we can pick on it and it'll have an elbow here and we can drag this elbow down for example to this corner here and then I can actually come over here and drag on this drag control uh, kind of move this thing around a little bit and I can say oh you know let's let's move it around so that it's something like this so it's got out in the open a little better so you know we can move these things around and I can drag you know if I don't get it just quite where I want it to be you know I can say yeah I want it to be right there and so I can manipulate my um, my controls on my callout bubble to get this you know out in a good area to be seen real well the next thing we can do is when I double click on my callout of the front door I can go into my instance properties and we want to go down and look through some of these instant properties and uh, the first thing we got is uh, a display model I can hit the down arrow and I can say I want that to be in half tone and it will actually display it as being grayed out and that's usually if we're going to draw over the top of it and we don't want to see that type of a thing and we can also say do not display and it doesn't display so we're we have remember we're building on top of this of what we want to draw and so the fault is normal in this case um, we can also go down to the underlayment and we can go as an underlayment we can pick any other uh, plan that we want any other view that we want like a floor plan and we can place that underneath as an underlayment uh, to to this particular view and uh, so we can do that as well to, to maybe pick up some uh, information from another floor that we might need if we also scroll down um, into our identity data to our view template in our view template if we click on it um, here we have different view templates so if I pick on my architectural plan a view template is a set of criteria um, that is applied and we can give different names to each view and so there for uh, some of the larger companies will set up view templates of all sorts uh, for their details and their elevations and their floor plans and etc that will control what and how they want to see things as far as their visibility uh, type things uh, are concerned we also have um, our name you know we can have the name of the view right here which I we already renamed once before call out of the first floor front door but we could also have a title on the sheet on the actual printed out drawn sheet in the title block we probably don't want it to say call out we might just say first floor front door detail which would be our title on our sheet so we would type that in here um, also we want to go down to up to our back up here let's go back up to our detail level our detail level is coarse right now and uh, if we go in here and take a look and let's go to medium and take a look what that is I'll hit apply and now we build more detail levels of our layers and components in here and since we are doing a detail we want detailed information we would want to put fine in here and we're going to apply that and so now we have all the layer uh, information all of the uh, information on based on each uh, elements individual layers that make up that particular component also a very important component to a callout is its view scale uh, typically a floor plan is drawn at a quarter inch equals a foot 
but most details are drawn at three quarters of an inch equals a foot or one inch equals a foot or an inch and a half equals a foot. I come over here and I can hit the down arrow and I can scroll up and I can pick these various sizes right here. I'll pick one and a half inches equals a foot and hit apply. And now it's bigger and larger for the craftspeople to read without having to squint and get their reading glasses and whatnot out. Because if we're looking at small details, we need to make things larger. So this is a very important detail is, is uh, what view scale we want to put our details at and, uh, and also what detail level we need to have. Um, so those are two of the most important aspects of our uh, callout view properties.